please, come on, come on, quiet down. Hey, hey, that means you too, Annie Bonnie. You've had your moment. <laughs> like, I just wanted to say a uh, massive thank you to everyone, everyone who helped pull off this surprise. I think it was, it was pretty clear. Marlon didn't suspect a thing. <laughs> well, today's been so much fun and I wanted to make a couple of toasts before we get back to all the dancing. <laughs> <laughs> so first of all, Mum, I'm so glad you found Marlon. He's opened up his home, his life, and his family to us, and I'll always be grateful for this. You two are perfect for each other. Hey, listen, I've finally got the most awesome little sister, yes? I'm looking at you, April. Mm -hmm. So can everybody please raise the glasses to the bride and groom. To the bride, to the bride and groom. And finally, finally, today's also been special because two worlds collide. Two families have come together and we're having the most amazing time with each other. So without sounding mm, too cheesy, <laughs> I want to raise a glass of family because without them, we're all lost. Family. <laughs> Son. Billy? Billy? Oh, what, what is it? Oh, this can't be happening. What? Did you know him? Yeah, I know him. He's Billy Fletcher. He was one of the scumbags that made my life hell in prison. Hey, hey. What are you doing? You can't kick off. It's Marlon's wedding. I missed you. Let's go. Can I not? Yeah. <laughs>